People in a central Iowa town have been trying to power through yeah. absolute heartbreak for a week now. Last Monday, 17-year-old Michelle Luna Jackson was found dead. KCCI's affiliate Jacobson shows us how one of her favorite places to go in the town of Farnhamville is honoring her memory and passions. Step inside Farnhamville Public Library and you'll find books, books, and more books. But if you take a closer look, she loved coffee. You'll find little things that remind library director Rebecca Slauson. She loved plants. Of 17 year old Michelle Jackson. It's really hard to be in here now when she's not here. Michelle was found dead last Monday. The murder investigation has rocked the small Iowa community to its core. It's hard because she was so young. It's hard because it's somebody that I got to know and really care about. Rebecca says the two spent a lot of time talking about the future, like how Michelle wanted to study meteorology at Iowa State, or how excited Michelle was for the library's Comic-Con. She was really, really excited about that. Rebecca says Michelle was at this library nearly every single day that it was open, and that's why she wants to keep her memory alive inside the library, just as much as it's being kept alive outside. I would really like to have some manga. That was another one of her um, passions. We've discussed maybe getting a indoor succulent garden. Rebecca says the ideas are endless and they're still coming up with new ones. But most of all, Rebecca hopes people will learn to see the library through Michelle's eyes. I want us to have the time to talk and really hear what each other has to say, get to know each other as not only a place to read, but a place to learn about others. In Farnhamville, Ophelia Jacobson, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.